Hey there everyone, this is Danielle, playing another Mario Maker 2 viewer level. Uh, this one is by Lyra, uh, here's the, here's the thing. Uh, WCKCM5GQF is the code, and yeah, so that sounds like my kind of thing. <laughs> like you know, like you know, yeah. <laughs> so let's take a look, and see how we go. Uh, it is a, um, 3D world level, because it's you know, cat themed, so it has to be 3D world level because that's the only way you can get cat, cat toadette. Uh, and I guess Meows is going to be in it as well, so let's look forward to that. Clear rate's kind of low, but the play rate's also kind of low, so it's probably not too tricky. Uh, I think this level is relatively recent. Okay, I can get a 1-up there. I can now break these because I'm big, so let's take a look down this pipe here. Uh, that doesn't look good. Uh. Um. Oh, okay. Oh, I see. Alright. Alright, so I can go across this lava because there's, like, stuff in it that you can, can't quite see. I think mostly swamps, judging from what I can see. Interesting. Okay, I can see a little piggy over there. Uh, I think that down arrow means I can go safely. No, that's a trap. <laughs> Oops. I wonder if I want to try to take these pipes and stuff. Let's try taking the pipe. No, that kills you. Okay, so you don't want to take that pipe. I assume you, you do have to use the... Um, ground pounding technique in that case. To go down here, then you can just run across this gap very easily. Uh, boom Boom just falls in the lava. You can just run across because it's really shallow lava, of course. Um, okay, so here I don't want to just jump down that hole. Let's go over here where the springboard is and see what we can find. Well, there's another springboard here. There's also a 50 coin, which might be useful. So let's... Try a ground pound with this cute little space. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> that was annoying. Okay, I think we drop the springboard in the hole like that, and then maybe the other springboard also in the hole like that. Oh, hello, a power block. Where did that come from? <laughs> Is that because I dropped the springboard in there? I guess. <laughs> so now if I can use that to do that, which lets me get in here. Okay. It's a bit of an interesting puzzle. Uh, uh, well, me Alza. Um, also, uh, death. Okay, I guess I have to fight Meowza. Uh, I have infinite fire flowers, so it's not hard, but Meowza's not really a good boss to fight because she keeps moving around like that and getting out of the area where you can actually attack her. Which is more of a chase kind of thing than a standard boss in, in my humble onion. Is it Meowzette? I think about it, because... You know, it's it's based on her normal name, and her normal name is Bowser, so I guess so. I really wish there was a way to save a power-up in this game, like there is in Super Mario World. And some of the new Super Mario Bros. games, but not the ones people actually play. Not the ones that Nintendo remember, anyway. I don't understand why they keep making games where you can't save power-ups after they had power-up saving as a big feature back in World. It's very annoying. There we go. Okay, so you get the key when you defeat her, which lets you unlock this box down here. There we go. Uh, I guess I just need to go this way. <laughs> I could try to cross the lava, but I don't really want to. Okay, what have we got here? We got we got a coin party. Oh, that's exciting. There's some stars having a little dance up there, but I don't think I can get them. 
So I can't break that ice with anything. Unless I can melt it? I don't think I can, though. Okay, I guess it's in the level. Um, so let's just jump on here. Yeah. There we go. Alright, so, um... There was no Super Bell in that whole level, which I find very strange, considering... The, the title of the level, Meowza's Doki Doki Hot Paw Panic, I was expecting to get a, a Super Bell so that I would have paws that could be hot, but that didn't happen, which is very strange. I don't think I missed anything? Uh, I might give the level one more quick look, just in case. Uh, in case I, like, missed something. Uh, I can't go down that pipe. But, oops. <laughs> I think I can. I, I can't go in any of those other pipes because I'm not standing on a surface. Uh, but maybe if I whoa, oh, so that's what that pipe is for. Okay. Nothing else up there by the looks of things. Uh, you can't look at levels in the editor that other people have made in in um Mario Maker 2, which is annoying. Otherwise, I'd have a quick look and see if I missed something. But yeah, I can't do that very easily. Okay, so I guess the level was just talking about how Meowza, Meowzette gets a, gets the flower because we don't? Interesting. That's an, that's an odd choice because, like, if you look at the um, original post again, which was this one, I think. Yes. You can see it says, don't be afraid to get your paws hot, but you can't get paws because you can't get a super bell in the level unless I've missed something, which is possible. Um, bizarre. Anyway, um, so that was the level. I enjoyed it. Um, uh, I, I think using Meowzette for a, a boss battle where you're supposed to defeat her rather than a chase sequence where you're supposed to just run away isn't ideal because of her behavior, how she keeps jumping off the screen and jumping back on and chasing you around and stuff. Um, unlike the um, Bowsette forms in other in the other styles, Meowzette, Meowzette is really built for a chase sequence, in my opinion. Uh, but it worked. It worked. It worked okay. Um, since you had infinite fly flowers and the ground was made of moving swamps, it was a little bit interesting. More so than it would be if it was just like a flat arena. Um, so it worked out okay. Um, yeah, yeah, it was a good level. Um, uh, thanks for make. I hope you enjoyed watching video. Um, 